I'm using these as vehicles. I'm still making money from haircut. It's still residual. That's my vehicle. Meaning I can carry this music freely to when I start dropping my own music, my own, like I have my own beats and things of that nature. These vehicles help me get here. Because this free stuff in the middle don't matter. This is just work. This is just this foundation. If I don't have this foundation, this building right here crumbles when that time comes. So this is our foundation in the middle. The free stuff, doing it for not making no money, doing it because of the love of it. That's my hard rock foundation. If I had that foundation, when I get here, it's impossible for my empire to crumble because it's built and structured correctly. Today we got one of them bangers on my young boy I got a dope drop fade with a design part Stick around, I promise y'all it's finna get like that If you new to my channel, please subscribe, hit that notification bell To get alerted when new videos come out, let's get it So I wanna start off by picking my clients here I wanna lift all this hair up I wanna look at the area and the campus for what it is Before I go in and decide to put my fade in this area Big shout out to my dog, Jerm. I know y'all had a cheers to you, player. I'm sliding. I'm feeling good this morning, man. Like, I'm in my Duffy right now. So I'm going to go in with a number two completely closed. Then I basically want to clear this area out. I want to go up, but as I go up and hit the Parado Ridge or the majority bulk of the hair, I want to lift off of the client head because I want to create a hard shape that's going to give him a flat top look. I want to give him that Duke starting five clean look. So y'all know exactly where I'm going right here. This finna be super fire, man. Like, I'm so stoked. I'm four weeks strong on this YouTube thing. Thing, and I'm glad that y'all just been able to stick around with me and kick it with me, man. Y'all know what time it is when being focused, when I'm locked in. It's demonic in them streets for them YouTube. So let's just focus, man. Number two guard, we clearing this bulk. I don't ever want to sound cocky to y'all. I'm just in my bag. Come on, bro. Last night we hit 500K. Any of the real subscribers that's in this building that been here since day one and that been here through the early days, y'all know how I feel. We up another level. I'm Mr. 500. I'm in that duffel this year. It's 2023. The lock in finna be amazing. More content, new music, EP coming. And soon videos we locked in let's start this ball line right at the bottom of the vertical bar area going into the c cup area because i want to show a little bit of that c cup area but i also want to give a drastic and a nice clean feather drop fade as you guys can see i dropped the fade towards the back of the head giving myself some room we're gonna break in with that one eighth guard which is considered a number one guard i'm completely closed because i know for a fact i devoked with a two i just did a ball line i go in with a one on close, I'm going to be using my one and a half and I'm going to be using my one sixteenth and then, you know, no guard to basically bring this fade all the way together. Boom. One and a half guard right here. That's completely halfway because I don't have to go completely open because I know I'm on the hilt of my blade. Using the hilt of my blade, I'm using the curvature of the blade to lift off the client head and create that feathered effect in a nice transition. So I'm just staying focused, flicking in and out, brushing one, fade one. I'm up like I'm just feeling it, man. I'm feeling it. My energy here today i'm just stoked man like i'm so glad y'all was able to stick around with me for 500,000. like we got 500k of them things like it's tough in these streets bro like we just man we just gotta we just gotta stay focused we gotta lock in roll to a milli y'all know how i feel like when i'm turned up we got that sample banging big shout out to my dog germ because come on like we slid this like you know how many people don't know about cheers to you uh player i know i got some of my older fan base in here and support system in here so i know the you know the, the the old school cats and the old school women know about this cheers to you player but if you in that 25 range or younger and you know something about this you slightly might be a goat and y'all know how i feel about that like when it comes to this music that, that's just how i feel so we completely closed here now i'm just basically playing in this debulking area now i'm completely open with no guard on so as you guys seen debulk with a two came in with a one guard then a one and a half now i'm finna drop these with no guard and then i'm gonna clean up in between and as you guys can see my transition is slowly but surely coming together and i'm creating that drop look fire just stay focused no matter what's going on like 
It's just you in the game, and that's just how I feel right now. I'm focused, like, I'm in majority of these shots, and I didn't record it like this purposely, but we gonna take advantage of me being in majority of the shots. Most of the time, I don't like to be in the camera. I just like my hands, the clippers, and the head of the client. As you guys can see, like, everything is coming together. The feathered effect's starting to look really good. I'm brushing one, I'm fading one, and I'm focused, like, I'm focused, man. I ain't been this focused in a long time. I've been getting a lot of my music done, and I'm just at a place in life right now where it's like I just I feel like I'm built for winning. Like, and I feel like everybody should feel like that. If you a part of my journey, if you've been watching me from the beginning, y'all know how it is. When we put that work in, that's how it gotta be. So I'm completely open right here, and I'm giving myself a half of an inch. As you guys see, I'm bringing the fade all the way together now. I'm slowly, you know, doing it. I could have did it in guidelines and did it quicker. But I like when I take my time. I like when I freestyle fade. I like when I lose myself in the guidelines. It keep me young. It keep me fresh in the game. It keep me focused. It keep me locked in. Because systematically, I can teach you guys how to fade with guidelines the easiest way. But this ain't a dummy proof fade right here. I can make it dummy proof, but I did it basically in the freestyle, you know, of beam. This was my last Chicago haircut. So, like, you know, I was getting as much conversation as I could in this and I was having you know my way so right here 116 completely closed let's bring the fade together different different y'all can't tell me y'all ain't sliding to this cheers to you like I'm so like I'm so cheesy and I'm so like I'm so smiley right now cause this is one of my favorite songs of all time and just to hit this slide when I'm doing my thing on YouTube is even greater like that's this is what I'm here for like I'm I, like I told y'all I'm built for this like we just gotta stay focused so now I'm gonna continue it start my ball line towards the bottom and I can kind of see where my spots are and I'm basically gonna try to wrap myself all the way around the head and give myself some more room now going in with my number two guard so i'm basically gonna follow some of the same steps debunk with that number two and i'm brushing one fade one slowly but surely it's taking my time That's completely closed Just taking my time Slowly but surely feathering it And watching this transition happen You know that's what professionals do It won't look beautiful The whole process won't look beautiful Sometimes it won't be easy And now completely open But I'ma stay true to the game I'ma stay true to my system And I'ma watch it all fall in place Too open I'ma match that bottom With that uh, bottom of the side area So I know that the fade Gonna kinda wrap around the head correctly And then right here My 116th completely completely open just debulking this area because i'm watching the fade come together so now i can kind of you know freestyle my technique opposed to stay completely true to everything that i was doing because i'm seeing the guidelines roll from the side of the head to the back of the head automatically so i know exactly where i am in my fade i'm on the corner of the two teeth of my blade i'm brushing one fade one turn i'm looking at that fade different different y'all know what time it is so let's go ahead let's continue we're gonna go ahead we're gonna use our trimmers our gamma style hitters and we just basically gonna work ourselves all the way around here i'm using these trimmers because they're not my primaries but these is my real good etch and sketch trimmers i like to create ball lines and hit the kids with these because they're not as sharp as my adult clippers so as you guys can see clean then i'm gonna go in here and i'm gonna basically use my number two guard and y'all know what i like to do when i get to this side of the head y'all know what we do man like we about elevation this year and when i'm talking about elevating i'm talking about going outside our norm chasing your dreams in 2022 can spill over to 2023 but it's bigger than chasing your dreams it's not just about the groundwork it's about getting it out in terms of that i got this music coming out i got this ep getting ready to get together i'm just getting music mixed and mastered right now but i'm going for broke like i'm going for broke i put my all i put my soul i put my heart into this tape i want y'all to just give it a chance give it a listen and i understand and know that there's a lot of bad music out there there's a lot of content creators who convert to music or try to convert to music and it don't work but at the end of the day i can't measure myself up based on the past or based on everybody else who didn't try to step in this lane i'm beaming i've been being for a reason i've been different 
I've been focused on a whole different level of this And I just sat down for a year to craft myself and hone myself in this I really hope you guys just give it a chance Give it a listen to it and I promise you like Lyrically is that, melodically is that The harmonizing is amazing The way the songs is put together The ad-libs down to the T's How I'm layering the tracks I hope you guys really, 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 really appreciate it It's going down this year So, as you guys can see I'm just slowly but surely bringing the fade together Now I'ma do some shaping work That's gonna bring majority of my whole fade together I need to get a lot of the ridges out the way And go back in with my 1A right here Just to re able to touch up some things that was in the fade And as you guys can see This thing is coming together Really well It's dropping beautifully Transition is looking really good And we just freehand And getting the majority Of this hair out the way And we finna prep it Y'all know what time it is When it's time to perform That kill shot When it's time to get Under them lights When it's time to get ready For that action That boy Beam Gonna step up to the plate And that boy Gonna always succeed Because I'm built for this Like I'm built for this it's casualties in this thing that we call war. And I promise you, I won't be one of them. We just gonna remain focused and we gonna bring this thing together. We gonna bring it home like this is a home run. This, I'm like, the base is loaded and I'm getting ready to go ahead and knock this joint out the park for y'all. So as you guys can see, I'm gonna go in with that one and a half. I'm gonna trim some of that hair down in the front. Not too much, not overly excessively, but I wanna thin out that area so I can get a nice, clean, hard line on the kid. It's finna go down. So I'm gonna go in with some spritz, some M spritz, and I basically wanna spray that into the hair, brush the tips of the hair, bring everything down, pull everything forward, and then I'm gonna center myself in the middle, cause the client got a fairly easy lineup. It's full, it's clean, it's rich, and y'all know me. I'm just finna get in my bag, I'm finna stay focused right here, and boom, I'm creating a nice, nice, nice front line. I'm starting myself in the middle, went to the left, and then we gonna drop. We finna do these vertical bars right here. Once I clean up this corner some, and we just finna bring this whole lineup together. Cause y'all know me in a place of the lineup, like the art of the lineup. It, you gotta be special to really be able to attack these lineups and just creating that nice symmetry look or a nice contour, sharp lineup on somebody's head. Cause everybody's head shape is different, foreheads is different, lineup density of the hair is different. But as long as you stay true to who you are in terms of what you do behind the chair, you can execute at any level. Gotta give my dog Jeremy another shout out. This be different. That boy Jerm different dog. Like Jerm different. When I do these samples, that boy know exactly where I'm trying to go. So I recenter myself in the middle, work myself all the way to the right. Slight presses, consistent, precise ones though. I wanna get these nice clean lines. Like I told y'all, I want a nice hard clean line in the front of the lineup. And I'm gonna bring it all the way together. I'm gonna measure up the vertical bars, make sure that them things straight. Then I'm gonna go into my C cup using the tip of my blade, creating that nice C to curved area. Different, different. Alright, now let's go ahead, let's break it to this freestyle, measuring it up to see how I want to attack it, because there's never just like, oh yeah, I'm going to do just this design, he just said throw a freestyle design in there, nothing too big, nothing that's too crazy, but give him something that's going to give it some pop, some flesh, some flash, and y'all know when I got to step up to that challenge, not just a design, but to get that pop, that flare, that flash, to get that swag to the haircut, to get that icy look, y'all know, it's Glacier Gang in that comment sections, and when I got to step up to it, I'm going to ice him every time So I'm just staying focused I'm using the edge of my blade And as you guys can see I'm bouncing between the left and the right edge of my blade And I'm just measuring myself up Giving myself room and nice clean lines It's just a rough draft But it's allowing me to see where I'm going Because I'm just really just trying to give him Something that's clean, that's precise And something that's, you know, efficient And something that's basically going to accommodate The contour of his head and the fade so i'm just you know consistent and just making sure everything coming together really well just hitting all my points they coming together fire now i'm gonna go with my 
boy Sean cuts hair, color enhancement car, and my color, no drip, assisting it with my Bean Team cordless compressor for all the barbers out there that want Tune 45 products. If you hit the link in my description, I have a discount code for you that is there. That every time you hit that link, the discount code is automatically attached to that link. Go buy your products, go get some of your stuff as you guys can see. I'm using the dark brown color, it's coming out really good, really clean, natural looking on the lineup. And the Bean Team cordless compressor got the nice, nice, nice pressure and airflow to push this color out. At, at this rate, and Sean Cuts Hair Color Enhancement Card is allowing me to stay in my boundaries. So as you guys can see, it's coming out real clean, real fire. And I just basically want to spray in some of his light areas throughout his fade. Like he not losing his hair, but just naturally some people got lighter areas in their hair than other people. So now I want to go in and I want to use some fibers in a design because I want to get a design more of like a 3D pop out. If I create some darkness in that area and re-hit the lineup once I hit it with spray. I'ma really bring the design out and I'ma really etch it out. And as you guys can see, let's start with the lineup. Let's bang out this uh, front area, the 90 degree right here in the curve. And then we're gonna clean up this area. Boom. And I go back in there using the corner two teeth for my blade. As you guys can see, I'm up close on the haircut. I'm in this personal space. But what I'm also being able to do is see this thing for what it truly is. I be a lot of barbers trying to be too cool to get too close in the client's, you know, area. Trying to do what they're trying to do. You want to be precise. You want precision. You want consistency. Then you're going to let your barber rock out. So the clients out there, let these barbers do their job, man. Let them do what they need to do to be able to get you guys as efficient and crispy as possible i'm locked in and a lot of this footage kind of got me in it and i kind of like that it got me in it because you guys can see my level of focus you can see i'm locked in i'm tuned in i'm trying to hit every line i'm trying to make sure that i'm able to give my client client satisfactory it is the hardest objective in the shop anybody can do a haircut but is that client gonna love it is that client gonna smile you get what i mean like it's a big difference between a a, a a good haircut and an amazing haircut and when it come to these transformations it come to changing people lives impacting people lives with just a haircut itself i'm destined for this this is what i do i instill confidence through every haircut y'all been watching me since i was a shorty y'all been watching me since i first went to college and was cutting hair i wasn't like that you know I had to create this over the years with the help of y'all support, 500,000 subscribers commenting, the engagement rate is up through the comment section. You know I'm able to like know some of my subscribers. We didn't build the community, we didn't build a family in this comment section. It's about support and not only support, it's about you know allowing people out there to chase their dreams and to support them no matter through whatever they go through to create you know all of the amazing things they're creating throughout their journey so i'm in here with the tune 45 precision pack pencil you hit that link you can get these precision pack pencils too it took me a long time but i understood this pencil game i had to come out with my own pencil to accommodate the streets of barbara y'all know me in tune 45 we don't just copy products at all we solve problems we made sure that the clay foundation for this pencil was perfect it can be dispersed across the skin really easy and as you guys can see as soon as i hit it one time with my trim it dispersed across the skin like super simple, super easy. That Tomb 45 Precision Pack Pencil. Hit that link in the, in the bottom of my description or at the top of my description. As soon as you scroll under the video at the top of my description and click that link. It got a discount code automatically attached to it and go get you some pencils. And as you guys can see, we got this real clean look. It's coming out fire. We backstroking, we leaning them back, and we just ensuring that we bringing everything to the highest points of them lines. And now we finna get into this design and really give it some pop, really give it some flair, really give it that precision. We're just taking our time. I got the client comfortable. He lean back. My razor angled at a 45 degree angle. I'm bringing everything back to those darker lines and really sure, like ensuring that I'm emphasizing them lines. Them lines is everything. They mean the most to me. 
So throughout this process, I gotta stay focused. And this is very, very, very dangerous when you, you know, using a razor in these areas. You don't wanna be too much on the tip of your blade because you can nick somebody's skin and cut somebody. So I'm just trying to stay consistent. I'm trying to keep my, my, my young boy comfortable in a chair. And I'm trying to give him the most precise haircut I could give him. And as you guys can see, I'm going with the grain now. I'm cleaning some more of that residue off the forehead from the holding spray and from the pencil. And we just getting it real solid and real clean. And as you guys can see, this joint coming out nice. Like, and I'm going to go in with some wrapping lotion, some lot of body wrapping lotion. And I just disperse it through the head evenly. And I'm going to go behind that using a curl sponge. And I'm going to bring it all the way together. Like, when I said Duke starting five, this is literally a Duke starting five haircut. This is what basketball players in college be rocking their hair like. Maybe without the design part, but this is it. Pretty much curly top, clean line. Up, dope drop fade, but I just gave him the design to take him up another level. In an imperfect world, we do get clients that come to us, grown or kids, and at times we got to use our expertise and our natural talent as barbers to bring them back and get them life in this thing that we call a nice clean haircut. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let's lock in. Y'all know what time it is. Hashtag TBT in that comment section. Hashtag Glacier Gang. Y'all know what time it is. It's 2023. It's year elevation. Let's put all that work that we've been chasing them dreams into real fruition, and let's heard them of what we have been doing y'all know what time it is my name is beam if you like this video please like share subscribe comment hit that notification bell to get alerted when new videos come out and may god bless all right let me know what you think what that down? Yeah. Right. Well, i think last time two months ago yeah all right all right youtube it's been two months since my young boy had a haircut. I posted that one on Instagram, just an Instagram story of it. A lot of people went crazy, it was like, bro, we want this video. And plus, I don't give y'all enough fades, drop fades, who out the band. Today I decided to do one. Let me know what y'all think about this one in the comment section, because I think we all know that this is a banger. Like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell to get alerted when new videos come out. And until next time. One last thing, man, 500,000 subscribers. We got 500k. I appreciate y'all, man. I appreciate y'all from the bottom of my heart. It's things like this that make me who I am. I couldn't do this without y'all. And like I told y'all earlier, we are gonna continuously grow. The content is coming out. The music is coming out. I thank everybody. I love you all forever. My name is Bean, and until next time, 